Hello everyone, I am Dr. Godhanda Raman. In this section, we are going to discuss with Willian Thompson method problem. Look at this problem. Find the analytic function f of z equal to u plus iv if u minus v equal to sin 2x by cos hy minus cos 2x. Willian Thompson method to find f of z when u is given, when v is given. But here, u and v both given. We can see how to solve this problem. First of all, here u plus iv is nothing but f of z u plus iv now to consider this is the equation number one because uh, z equal to x plus iy f of z u plus iv so function of complex variable now to multiply i on both side when i multiply i here i into f of z then i u plus i square v multiply i on both side i square value minus 1 therefore here i u minus v so i into f of z to consider this the equation 2 adding equation 1 2 therefore f of z plus i into f of z equal to u plus i v plus i u minus v now to combine with real and imaginary part here real is nothing but without i real with i imaginary so u minus v plus i into u plus v now f of z 1 plus i f of z i am taking common now here this term u minus v the entire term let I am taking capital F of z equal to capital U plus I into capital V. So here the given U minus V therefore U minus V is U. Let U equal to U minus V is nothing but sin 2x divided by cos H2y minus cos 2x so therefore here u x u y to calculate because of a million thompson method millions thompson method to find f of z here i consider capital f of z so therefore capital f of z when capital u is given therefore f of z equal to integral pi 1 of z comma 0 dz minus i into integral pi 2 of z comma 0 into dz for here pi 1 of z is nothing but where pi 1 of z comma 0 equal to capital ux of z comma 0 and then pi 2 of z comma 0 is nothing but capital u y of z comma 0 so this is a from capital u when to find f of z when u is given now this is a formula for million thompson method now to calculate pi 1 of z comma 0 pi 2 of z comma 0 substitute in this formula you will be find the value of f of z so this is a u capital u capital u equal to sin 2x minus sorry divide by cos h2y minus cos 2x now differentiate ux now differentiation nothing but d by dx divided by uv rule v u dash minus uv dash by v square now the derivative d by dx of sin ax d by dx of cos ax 
and then d by dx of sin h a x d by dx of cos h a x is nothing but a cos a x here minus a sin a x here a cos h a x a sin h a x. So, h is nothing but hyperbolic function. So, therefore, now v u dash what is a v? This is a cos h 2 y minus cos 2 x. This is a v u dash sin 2 x differentiation is 2 cos 2 x and then minus u sin 2 x this is the u v dash cos h 2 y constant 0 minus of minus plus 2 sin 2 x whole divided by cos h 2 y minus cos 2 x whole square. From this equation pi 1 of z comma 0 is nothing but u x of z comma 0 where x substitute z y substitute 0. For this equation I am going to substitute the first two term cos 0 minus cos 2 z cos 0 y term. So, cos 0 cos 2 z then 2 into cos 2 z and then minus sin 2 z and then 2 sin 2 z divided by cos 0 minus cos 2 z whole square. So, first term 1 minus cos 2 z 1 minus cos 2 z then 2 into cos 2 z and minus 2 into sin square 2 z divided by 1 minus cos 2 z whole square. For this term multiply with this 1 minus cos 2 z so 2 cos z to multiply with inside this value 2 cos 2 z minus 2 cos square 2 z minus 2 sin square 2 z divided by 1 minus cos 2 z whole square just multiply inside this bracket. So, 2 cos 2 z I am taking 2 common therefore, cos square 2 z plus sin square 2 z divided by 1 minus cos 2 z whole square. For this term cos square 2 z plus sin square 2 z value 1 the whole term 1 therefore, 2 cos 2 z minus 2 by 1 minus cos 2 z whole square. Now, I am taking minus 2 common therefore, 1 minus cos 2 z divided by 1 minus cos 2 z whole square. Now, 1 term to cancel now minus 2 by 1 minus cos 2 z. 1 minus cos 2 x is nothing but 2 sin square is it 2 sin square is it 1 minus cos 2 x 1 minus cos 2 x equal to 2 sin square x. Therefore, 2 to cancel minus 1 by sin square is it minus 1 by sin is cosecant cosecant square z. This is a pi 1 of z comma 0. So, u x of z comma 0. And then next this is a u. Okay. This is a u derivative with respect to y. 
to calculate this u y. So, pi 2 of z comma 0 is nothing but u y of z comma 0. Now, as usual v u dash minus u v dash by v square. What is the rule? d by d x of u by v v u dash minus u v dash by v square. The denominator is v cos h 2 y minus cos 2 x into u dash. So, derivative with respect to y. So, the term is 0 minus u sin 2 x then cos h 2 y is 2 sin h 2 y minus 0 divided by cos h 2 y minus cos 2 x whole square and then sub the first term 0 and this term minus 2 sin 2 x sin h 2 y by cos h 2 y minus cos 2 x whole square. So, this term to replace z comma 0 substitute where x substitute z where substitute y 0 therefore minus 2 sin 2 z sin 0 by cos 0 minus cos 2 z the whole term sin 0 0 therefore 0 so pi 2 of z comma 0 pi 2 of z comma 0 u y of z comma 0 0 substitute this value to the million thompson formula capital f of z integral pi 1 of z comma 0 d z minus i into pi 2 of z comma 0 d z when i substituted this minus cosecant square 2 z d z then 0 therefore now when i integrate cosecant square is nothing but cot cot z capital f of z now the capital f of z is nothing but 1 plus i into small f of but the question is small f of is analytic function so cot z therefore f of z equal to cot z by 1 plus i 1 plus i so this is a value suppose the denominator to remove this i to write into the numerator then multiply conjugate taking conjugate 1 minus i numerator and denominator or multiply i for numerator and denominator it will be change i into cos z then i here any possible only multiplication i it is not possible so take the conjugate 1 minus i numerator and denominator it will be change so multiplication if you want to make it this to continue 1 plus i so 1 minus i by 1 minus i therefore 1 minus i into cot z divided by a plus b a minus b so a square minus b square therefore this is a minus 1 plus 1 1 minus i by 2 cot z so this is our f of z value thank you